Hubodometers provide a simple way to measure the miles on your trailers so you know when it's time for maintenance. Today, I'm going to show you how to program the odometer. There are four settings you can select. The unit of measure, revolutions per mile, starting mileage, and whether security is on or off. You program your odometer with this tool, which is just a small magnet. You use it by holding the tool over these two targets, left and right. To start programming, hold the tool over the left target until you see the serial number. This may take as long as 10 seconds. Keep holding and the display will change to show zero revolutions. Keep holding and the display will show Pro 9. There's no rushing these wait times. Tapping the left target again or moving the tool away will just exit the programming process. Be patient. Now you can start programming. Pull the tool away and then tap the left target. Select the unit you want to use by tapping the right target to cycle through the four options. Mile, kilometers, acres, and hectares. After selecting the units, tap the left target again to program the revolutions per mile based on the tire diameter. Your tire provider should be able to help you determine this number. The first digit to the left blinks. Tap the right target to change the number or tap the left target to move to the next digit. This can go pretty quickly, just keep tapping the target. You have to cycle through all of the numbers right down to the tenth of a mile before you can go to the next programming step. If you don't, the odometer will exit programming and you'll have to start over. After you cycle through all the numbers, the odometer moves to the next setting, the starting count. If you need to set this mileage, do it just like you set the revolutions per mile using the left and right targets. Remember that you have to keep tapping the left target to cycle through all of the numbers. The next thing to set is security on or off. If you want to lock the odometer so it can't be reprogrammed, tap the right target to turn security on. Here's a warning though, if you set security on, the odometer can never be reprogrammed, preventing anyone from tampering with it. The odometer will ask you to confirm that you want to turn security on by showing a yes or no prompt. Tapping the left target for yes locks the odometer with the settings you just entered. Tapping the right target for no takes you back to programming the security option. After going through all the steps, the display will show Pro 9 again. After about 10 seconds, the odometer will display the miles indicating the settings have been saved. It takes a little time to get used to using the programming tool, but once you've got it, programming your odometer is very easy. I'm Rick Dahman. This has been a Timken Tricks of the Trade video, helping you build your service knowledge.